Hey guys, Andrew here with DrewFit. I want to thank you for tuning in. Today's video going to be a quick one for you guys, um, and it's more geared towards the female audience, but I'm sure males will want to watch this as well. And that is, how do I grow a better butt? Now, when people are asking this question, essentially what they want is a butt that is not perpendicular, straight up and down with your spine. They want something that, you know, your lower back kind of dips in a little bit and then goes to a nice voluptuous booty um, that has good shape and good strength to it, um, good gluteus maximus, good gluteus medius. Um, and the best workout for that is not going to be found in your gym. Um, and the reason being is a lot of these workouts that are great for targeting the gluteus uh, maximus and gluteus medius, a lot of people don't have the right technique and form to actually do this and activate those muscular groups, whether they're doing squats, deadlifts, Romanian deadlifts, um, pistol squats, whatever it is. Um, a lot of people are missing the mark here when they're doing those exercises, and that's why they're not seeing that great of results. Um, so my favorite exercise, um, it's pretty simple. There's definitely some good technique to uh, pay attention to, um, and that is sprinting. Sprinting is fantastic, not just for the gluteus maximus and gluteus medius muscles, but just all of your muscles as a whole. Um, I think it increases the aesthetic look to your body by about 5 to 10% in my opinion. There's no studies backing that up. That's just my sheer opinion. I noticed that when I'm in a consistent um, you know, time period of practicing sprinting about once weekly, that I notice significant changes to my body for the better. So it's a great tool for people to add in. Um, and the reason being why it's so good is that it helps activate fast twitch muscle fibers as compared to people that do long distance cardio that's activating those slow twitch muscle fibers. Um, and the difference being is fast twitch is for short bursts um, of strength that you want to utilize to where uh, slow twitch muscle fibers are used for long distance training. Um, so you'll see uh, the Olympics are just last week. You can tell a significant difference between the people that run the 100, 200 meter, even 400 meter um, the difference of their body compared to the 1500 meter up to marathons where they are very stringy bodies, very uh, lengthy, long, flat looking muscles. Um, ideally, I don't like that look at all. Um, I'm more geared towards the sprinting type body um, and I think a lot of people are as well. Um, but specifically, if you want to build a better butt, look into sprinting, um, get a good training regimen and train with a partner. Um, because it is kind of taxing on the body and uh, a safe bet to start off. Obviously, you want like a couple down and backs of 100 yards, just very light, um, doing different strides to, you know, loosen up those muscles. And then you want to jump into about four to six reps of about 50 yards to 100 yards, depending on where you're at with your current uh, state of health, um, of going balls to the wall as fast as you can. Um, and rule of thumb here, you want high knees, high elbows, keeping everything tight as you are running. Um, you can get into much, much more um, strict technique when doing this. Um, I don't think it's necessary, but to avoid injury, it might be something to look into. But in my opinion, sprinting is often overlooked, um, especially when people are talking about exercises for growing the butt, making it look better. Um, so I hope this video helps you guys. If you have any questions, comments, or testimonials, drop them below and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.